Hi, I'm Amy from East Bears, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to find the model number on your lawnmower. If your lawnmower develops a fault and is in need of replacement parts, then knowing your model number is the best way to get the correct parts for your machine. Some spare parts may look very similar, but can vary slightly to suit specific makes and models. So having your model number on hand when you're looking for spare parts is the best way to ensure you're getting the correct parts for your lawnmower. If you're diagnosing a fault with your lawnmower, your model number can come in handy there too as you can search for common problems with your specific make and model. Another reason why knowing your model number is important is for the safety of your appliance. You may have heard news reports of manufacturers recalling appliances from time to time due to safety concerns. These recalls do happen and they can affect any one of your household appliances. Continuing to run your appliance after it's been recalled is a danger to you and your home. When a manufacturer does issue a recall, they'll release a series of makes and models of all the appliances affected by the issue. So if you know your model number, you can check through the list and find out whether yours has been affected and whether it needs to be repaired or replaced to make it safe. For more information on appliance recalls, take a look at our video up here and we'll link even more about appliance safety at the end of this video. So now let's talk about finding your model number. The information you should need will be on a sticker or a rating plate somewhere on your machine. So the first place to check is the back, as this is where most of them are located. As you can see on this fly mote, here's the rating plate. But if yours isn't there, it could be on the underneath of your machine. And if it isn't there, you need to check the top, the front and the sides of the chassis. And if you still can't find it, then lift up the grass collection box and have a look at the bottom and the side of it. If your model number has become faded or rubbed off, then not to worry, we can still help you find the information you need. Take a look at our video up here where we explain what to do if your model number is no longer readable or you just can't find it. Now that we've located the model number, here's the information that you need to look out for. The format of the model number and the product or serial number can vary depending on the manufacturer. But the model number format typically consists of numbers and letters and can contain special characters such as forward slashes and dashes. Some manufacturers also indicate the model number by starting it off with mod or model. All Flymo lawnmowers have a model name. This one is the HC300 model. They also have a specific product number, which you will also need. And on this one, it's 9633034-01. They're usually in this format, which consists of nine digits and starts with the number nine. It also includes a dash followed by the last two digits. There's also a serial number which you'll need to take note of too, and as you can see on this one, it's 85101739. Just to emphasise this point as well, here's a different model of Flymo, the Microlite. So as we can see here, we have the model name, the Mlite 28, and it still follows the same structure with a nine-digit product number and the serial number here too. McCulloch branded lawnmowers actually follow the same structure as Flymo. For example, this model is the M40125 Classic and it has a nine digit product number and also a separate serial number too. Another example is Bosch lawn mowers because they'll have a model number and also a 10 digit unique product number. The model number format on other models may differ so just remember to always look for a sequence of letters and numbers. We hope this video has helped you find the model number and the other important information you need on your lawn mower. Remember to take note of these should you ever need spare parts for your mower. If you do need spare parts for your lawn mower, we'll link a place on our website down below where you can find them. As promised as well, here are a range of videos on appliance safety tips so you can keep your lawn mower and your other appliances safe. For more helpful videos on maintaining, diagnosing and repairing your household and your garden appliances, make sure you hit that subscribe button below. Thanks for watching.